And next, a battle considered by some to be one of the greatest last stands in military history. In the Battle of Saragari, 21 Sikhs died defending an army post in what is now Pakistan. And they were led by a former Rutland schoolboy, Lieutenant Colonel John Horton. Well, on the battle's 120th anniversary, a new film has been released detailing what happened on that day when the British Indian Regiment, the 36th Sikhs, saw action for the very first time. Amy Harris has more. A hundred and twenty years after one of history's greatest last stands, its story is being told through film. This is the result of seven years of research created to ensure the sacrifices of Sikh soldiers in Saragari are never forgotten. Saragari is immensely significant within frontier history. Uh, 21 Sikh soldiers defending a small outpost, which they didn't have to, against 10,000 enemy tribesmen. Rather than surrendering or, or, or wilting away, they, they stood firm, they, they maintained their reputation as brave and courageous Sikhs. The soldiers were among the 36th Sikh regiment of the British Indian Army, sent to defend a colonial outpost during tribal tensions on the northwest frontier. The regiment was led by Lieutenant Colonel John Horton, who went to Uppingham School in Rutland. Staff here believe it helped shape him. I'm sure that the DNA uh, of military intuition was already in John, but I think his spiritual and moral compass was set here. Here in the chapel at his former school, Lieutenant Colonel John Horton is permanently remembered. And more than a century after he and his comrades made the ultimate sacrifice, a new generation of Sikhs want more recognition of the Battle of Saragari.